Hello everybody and welcome back to the save file. We are jumping in again and perfectly we get to jump in as Golem this time around. We unlocked him in the last episode by gulping five trinkets, which is something that I actually can't believe that we managed to do. Um, there is a lot of things in uh, in this game that I didn't, that, well, in unlocks wise that I thought were going to take a while and that was not one that I thought I was going to get very early. So yeah, very surprised by that. Um, we'll grind that up for free and we get when the player drops to one red heart or less um heals red hearts and breaks plus one soul heart if holding another geode and it's something and then this one we can crush and we'll take that there you go nice bit of hp i like the little dude on top of our head we'll see what else we can get we'll try and find secret rooms and stuff Ooh, teleporter 2.0 is actually good for getting a deleted unlock so very, very nice, actually. Very, very nice. So, we do have to go everywhere and do everything. Hey, flesh chest unlocked. Um, oh, I tried I tried to use the iframes there. It didn't quite work. Um, yeah, um, we have to go everywhere and do everything to make this work. Like, we have to go to all the secret rooms and everything. But, this could be pretty good. Um, our dude firing a random direction. I think he just changes direction. He fires each room. And we get a... Soul of Lazarus. Something fishy's going on with this save file. Why did a Soul of Lazarus just spawn? What's that about? I def I definitely don't have that unlocked. So I'm I'm really confused as to why that's just spawned. If anyone can let me know what the hell's going on, like. The only area I have in my console is the Job one. So I'm not really sure what's going on with that. Unless it's that error that's causing stuff, but I don't see how it could be. I'm very confused, I'll be honest. I'm very, very confused. Um, that is... Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> we've had a few instances like this where we've found items we shouldn't and stuff like that. So... Are things properly locked is the question. They should be. But are they actually? Well, I guess we'll find out through whatever items we get. Also, we don't have an item tracker. Oh, no, no, it doesn't matter. We do have an item tracker. It's just we got an active item. I, for some reason, thought my trinket uh, was smelted. It's not smelted yet. I'm stupid. Don't listen to me. I have no brain. Yeah, this is this is strange. There's some, there's some odd happenings going on in this save file. Some very odd happenings. I will say I did... I did change one of my mods recently, so that might have caused an issue. We had a, a mod on called No More Baby Unlocks, which essentially swaps all the baby unlocks out with um, actual item unlocks. But I hadn't actually taken a proper look at that mod, and recently I did, and I had to uninstall it because the, the items that it had locked were rid ridiculous. It basically just locked every fun item. Um, and most of them were locked behind full com uh, full character save files. Like, Sacred Heart was locked, Polyphemus was locked, Brimstone was locked, um, 2020 was locked. Like, basically every fun item that you can get, like, every powerful item you can get early on was just locked. And it's like, eh. Like, I like the idea of, 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 of I like, items being unlocked and stuff, but locking, like, every good item and every fun item, especially, like, Brimstone and Sacred Heart, behind, um... Full character unlocks, like I have to get every completion mark. I'm sorry, but no. <laughs> it would be forever until we saw any of those items. Like, a legitimately really long time. So I decided to uninstall that. But I asked on the Discord, and people said that it wouldn't cause any errors with unlocks. So I'm hoping it hasn't. Uh, but I guess we'll have to see. Um, oh, I'm a little wary of this situation. This is a bit of a weird room, really. <laughs> It's not too difficult, actually. The uh, the spike blocks here aren't so bad. Oh, that one was a bit stupid, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Yeah, so hopefully that hasn't caused, like, errors with our unlocks. I really hope it hasn't. But that isn't the first time we've seen a soul stone we shouldn't have, I'm pretty sure. So, Oh my god, how did that hit me? So we'll see if that's a persistent issue or not, I guess. And if anyone can figure out why it's caused, let me know, because I would like to stop that happening, because the whole point of a new save file is that we don't have everything unlocked. 
We do have a lot of money here. Uh, let's see who our boss is at. Good old monster. Why do I keep walking directly into enemies? If anyone can also tell me why that's happening. I'm guessing it's some sort of brain defect that I have. Um, then that would also be nice. Because, yeah, that is something that I have been doing quite a lot. Um, if you could make your way kindly over here. There you go. I just want to be able to stand here so my little... Dude, get to the middle of the screen, please. So my little, uh, my little head dweller can do some extra damage for me. He's, he's pretty good, but it's, it's kind of hard to get him into position to deal damage because Monstro is having a really lovely time over in the very far right of the screen right now. Just get over here. I guess at this point it doesn't really matter, but there you go. There you go. Killed him a little bit faster. Um, shop items are one cent cheaper. Spawn three pennies, one crushed. I guess that's better than this. And Toy Drum is really, really good. Right. Oh, God. Be careful, be careful. Right, try and find secret rooms first. Go check out our shop as well. I can't remember what was in our shop now. There was something for sale, I'm sure, but uh, I don't remember what it was. Honestly, considering this wasn't an XL floor, this floor was absolutely massive. And I'm not entirely sure where the secret rooms are, I'll be honest. What are you doing here? What are you here for? Uh, Burger Bombs is probably worth a buy. Sli slightly annoying, it doesn't give us any bombs when we use it. Um, secret Rooms. Soul of Lazarus. Why? I'm, I'm so confused by that. I'm so confused by that. I really hope our unlocks aren't just utterly buggered. Um, we could have a secret room here. Uh, let's go check that. The validity of that, actually. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna gamble and say here. But well, doesn't matter then. We can't do anything this floor. Might as well just use this. Speed up, shot speed down one second. Sorry, I had a really big sneeze there. Oh, um, other secret room location. We've got burger bombs. We'll get more bombs in the future. So let's uh, let's try this out. Really? Not there either? This is a ridiculously large floor. I, I don't know what the hell happened here for a first floor. But what is going on? This is like the biggest basement one I've ever seen. Legitimately. This is ridiculous. It's like a third, fourth floor size. Crazy. I don't know what happened there. Anyways. Uh, oop, I have the wrong one of these. There you go. I want to leave you on the floor. I could crush you and I'm, I'm forgetful. I realized that after exiting the floor, so boo, boo me, I guess. Boo me. Extra money there, lovely. As for the question of the day today, as for the question of the day today, ooh, ooh, that is that is a good one. Um, oh, when it was the last time you got like you went a bit too hard on physical exercise or did something physical that kind of wrecks you? Because I did that exactly yesterday. Um, I, uh, because it's the new year, and because I want to try and be fit and all that sort of good jazz. No, okay. I might have broken things by uninstalling that mod, honestly. I might have, because, like, what the hell's going on here? Right, one second. Okay, I am perplexed by this. We have to just keep playing and see, see how it goes. It might be something that I can fix. I really hope it is. Because I'm going to be really bummed out if I've buggered that up by uninstalling that mod. I might just have to reinstall it, but at the same time, I kind of don't want to. Maybe, maybe I should have done my research into what the mod actually did. That would have been a good idea, wouldn't it? That would have been a good idea, but a bit late for that one. A bit late for that one. Ow. I need to play better as well. I'm playing like dog shit recently. This is just, yeah, anyways, what I was saying was, um, because it's a new year and I'm trying to be fit and stuff, my, my friend's a runner, and so I decided to go running with him, and oh my god, did a 5k run, and oh, was my body just not ready for that at all. I, I, I did it yesterday morning, and I still ache so much, like so, so much. It's unbelievable how much I ache, actually. <laughs> oh my god. I, I was going to go to gym today, but I don't know. 
I'll have to see. Uh, on, and if I do, I'm going to have to be, take it real easy. Because goddamn. Yeah, very, very achy. See what we can get out of our shop here as well. We've got quite a lot of money already. I would like a soul heart. Couldn't get a soul heart, sadly. Um, two cent for two bombs is pretty awesome, though. I will definitely take that. And there's also a battery available. Which means that if we find our secret rooms, things could go well for us. It's just finding our secret rooms. Okay, we have a ton of bombs, so finding our secret rooms shouldn't be a massive issue. Hey, the Abyss Locusts coming in clutch. So many bombs, right. Check this out. Yeah, that's one of them done. It's an Eternal Heart as well. Uh, let's, let's go and destroy our boss with the uh, Abyss Locusts here. Awesome. Explosions cause uh, rocks that deal two times tier damage to fall from the sky, fall projectiles. That's pretty good. Um, let's quickly go down here. Uh, I'll grab this first, actually. Let's go down here. I've got... I'm actually just going to crush both of these, I think. Oh, for fuck. I didn't want to do that. Why, game? Why? Right. I'm actually just going to crush both of the ones that I have right now. They're both... Why did that one give me money? Oh, because it gives me money when crushed, I see. Thank you. Give myself some protection. And I'm just going to carry this one. Um, oh, I went through the wrong place. Whoopsie. Uh, I can go in here now, though, which we kind of need to do. Bloody card. Pretty insanely good. Um, experimental pill as well. Ooh, stars. Experimental Health up as well. Up. Stars to get out for free. <laughs> Okay. Just need to find our secret rooms now. We've been to our devil deal as well. Did we go to our devil deal? Yes? No. Did we go to our devil deal? I don't think we did. That's pretty bad because I kind of need to go in there. Bollocks. Bollocks. Is it still open? It's not still open. Fuck. Okay, that, that, this might have been a waste then. Anyways, let's try and find our secret rooms first. Um, we found one of them there. All the ones probably up from here. That it is. And we have some falling rocks there as well. Hello. Um, chance to get a shield. We also got this. Uh, for the next 10 seconds, spinning coins are spawned every 13 frames. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Okay. Now we want to use this, which will take us to the devil room, which I'm annoyed about. But it's fine. I don't think I want any of these, to be honest. Now I've got to go use it again, and it should take me to the error room, I think. It did. Delete it has been unlocked. Unfortunately... A very, very terrible error room. Oh, wait, no, actually. <laughs> Not so bad. We got some freebies here. Okay. Awesome. We have unlocked the deleted. We have unlocked the deleted. Teleport 2.0. Came in a clutch right there and then. But yeah, people are going to have to, like, point out to me modded items that should be locked that I'm getting. Because I'm sure there's going to be a few that I get here and there. Where I get modded items that I shouldn't be getting sort of thing. I really hope that isn't the case. I really hope the save file isn't like completely buggered now or something. We'll see. Basically what I think has happened is the uh, mod edits the items.xml file. And upon removing that mod while during a save file... The game has gotten confused about where my save file should be, and so it's defaulted to having everything unlocked. That, that's my current theory. But the thing is, I might be completely wrong about that, so don't, don't take me at face value for that, because I might be completely wrong. It could just be that something else is buggered, and I'm some, sometimes going to see soul stones when I shouldn't. Do you know what? Help out here. Why, why am I entertaining that? Oh, bloody tiny little mushroom fucker. Okay, take as much damage as you possibly can, why don't you? It's 
good. Wheel of Fortune, we'll just put down there. We got so many bombs, holy hell. Oh, we got uh, another one of these, didn't expect that. Definitely need some more actual damage. So that's not going so well so far. Apparently, uh, we feared everything upon using that bomb. Maybe that's to do with the uh, pumpkin bombs, spooky ones. Silver Flesh. We've seen how utterly broken and overpowered this item is, so thank you very much. Um, bump, 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 burn, dun. Right. Wait a minute. No, no, no. I want those two. Good. Go down here real quick. I do love Golem. Golem's such a fun character. Hey. I can't remember what you do. Size down. And then we've also got chance to fire a bouncing tennis ball. Ooh, that's pretty good. We'll keep that. And then we can crush that. Crush that. And keep these two. I'm happy with that. Good amount of HP out of that. Pretty happy with that thing there. Okay. Thing is, we're going to be slow on this run because we're trying to go to all the rooms, so don't expect us to be hitting boss rush this time around. Oh, I... Members card, we, di we definitely did unlock in greed mode. I remember that, so that's fine. It is an unlockable, but it's an unlockable I remember getting, so that's fine. <laughs> so far, I don't think I've seen any items that we shouldn't be having, so that's good. I'm just worried that it's going to be more stuff that we that, that's unlocked that shouldn't be sort of thing. But it's going to be hard for me to decipher, especially modded content, what, what should be unlocked and what shouldn't. Oh god, these mushrooms. These bouncy boys are difficult. Right, we definitely need more damage. Our damage is dookie. Hot, stinky cat dookie. Right. Let's carry on. Also, look for our, where our secret rooms could possibly, possibly be along the way here. Oh god, damn. These guys are on one. They're all beef caked up. I thought the bruising would do a bit more than that to them then. Uh, we'll go in here as well. Um, I don't know if this is worth doing, but I'll try it. Why not? It was not worth doing. I thought I'd maybe get an additional... Oh, no, no, no. I got a half soul heart there. Okay. I got the cost of entering back. Thank you, at least. That's not too bad. I still, yeah, I don't have any idea where Secret Room could be here. Ooh, what the hell? It's a floating rosary. Really? It filled up every gap apart from the one where I can actually get rosary. Now that's upsetting. I want the rosary. Good HP. Good tears. It's all it's all good, man. I'm liking this Falling Rocks thing. It'd be nice if we had our own way of triggering it, if we had our own explosives. But even without our own explosives, it's pretty good. I mean, obviously we have a lot of bombs. That's our own explosives, technically, but not really what I'm looking for, sort of thing. Ow. Okay, there's a half soul heart. Luckily, Silver Flesh is going to be paying out like crazy. We got what looks like a cricket's head style looking thing there. Not quite sure what that is. Max's fossil. Um, howls when next to a secret room. When crushed, the next tinted rock the player encounters is revealed. Ooh, I think I just want to straight up keep that. Um, although I'm not sure what for. I, unfortunately, I think it's going to have to be the explosions thing because I think that's just not as good as the um, the bruising. But howling next to secret rooms really, really useful for us. Right, was it this room that it howled in? It's probably off the back of here. It is. We got some glitch pickups here. I'm hoping for a battery. We got at least a battery good. And then other secret room we can just walk around and find. This is going to be really good for uh, playing out. So other secret rooms are off of here somewhere. Which probably means that it's uh, 
directly down from here. Beautiful. We've also got this. Um, I think this is one that we're going to throw away real quick. We will chuck you into here. I oh, just gave us the same one back. That's fair. We'll crush you up. Give us a soul heart. Thank you. Back in here to grab this. Excuse me. Um, then we want to go and do our last few rooms here. Then we can start using the rosary to get into all the deals and stuff like that. Golden teleport at 2.0 is just so good. Tinted rock there. Lovely. Just get so many bombs here. It's, it's kind of ludicrous. And then we've cleared out all the rooms here. So we pop this. It'll take us to Devil Deal. Which we get Brimstone Bombs. Which I think is just an absolutely fantastic pickup here. Question. Is Brimstone Bombs something we should have unlocked already? Let's find out. Brimstone Bombs. Um... After breaking Hornfelt's minecart and, kill and killing him before he esca can escape. Oh, wait, no, we did that. I was like, we haven't done that. We did do that because we did it in, um, we did it in greed mode. So that's fine. I'm getting worried, but like, yeah, that's, that's actually completely fine. We have done that. That's completely fine. And then error room again. Unfortunately, our error rooms have not been good so far. Like, that first one was okay because we got some items out of it, but the items weren't great. I am liking this, though. Right, we'll check in here. We can chisel both of these onto us, I think. Be pretty happy about them. Both of these are pretty darn good. We'll move along. Okay, these things can die. But yeah, having brimstone bombs and locust bombs with the amount of bombs that we currently have is, is pretty awesome. We have a lot of bomb upgrades going. And as you can see, the, uh, the locusts actually work with brimstone bombs too, which is just insanely good. Two more soul hearts, lovely. We didn't get a howl here. I'm really hoping the howl still works when it's smelted. I'm pretty sure it should, though. I'm pretty sure it should. Yes, it does. Okay, nice. Um, and so that means it has to be here. The coffin has been unlocked. Tears have a chance to apply the effect. Tears have a chance to apply the effect scale to the look. Effect is an aura on the floor which spawns holy light when enemy touches it. Okay, nice. I like that. This one doesn't count because we already know about that one. Lots of big rooms here, unfortunately. They're always a pain. Yeah, locust bombs, so good. The brimstone bombs on top of that. Just top notch. Don't know why I decided to play that that way, but it it, it kind of worked out. I'm taking damage I shouldn't be taking, but oh well. And here's our other secret room here. I keep getting hit by these enemies. I, I'm so bad. Hmm. I've just realized something very peculiar. The brimstone from the locusts is able to hit me. I was wondering what I was getting hit by constantly. Yeah, the brimstone from the locusts, as you can just see there, is able to hit me for some reason. And I'm not entirely sure why. Is it able to hit me from a regular brimstone bomb? No? Just the ones from the locusts. I'm gonna have to be very careful. The catacombs has been unlocked. Good, good. Uh, that's pretty good. Yeah, we, we took a lot of damage there from stuff that we really shouldn't have. Um, pretty unavoidable not knowing about that. Also, a bloody card hasn't procced a single time yet. I've been holding this rune in my pocket, ready for uh, bloody card to proc even once, and it just hasn't. Okay, 
Yeah, this is kind of scary. Okay, we've got two more brimstone flies here. We've got to basically stay the hell away from them because otherwise we're going to take damage. They do a lot of damage to us, which is uh, for, for, for us, sorry, which is nice, but they can also do damage to us, which is something that I think is a complete error. By the way, how on earth did we get Minx plus the, um, plus the, what's it called again? Minx, go after that guy. Damn it. Minx plus the um, Silver Flesh again. Like a super overpowered combo that can lead to infinite HP and we got it again. Ow. Remote detonator. It would, would give us five bombs if we pick it up, so we might as well pick it up. Move around this. Yeah, we keep getting these crazy powerful combos over and over again. It's kind of weird. Lovely. Nice bit of rainbow poopies. We still haven't found... Oh, no, we did find a second secret room. I'm a, I'm a stupid. We already found it. They get herming every now and again. That's nice. Honestly, we might as well just throw bombs out constantly, because... <laughs> I, I got hit by it twice. I'm so stupid. Check out the shop here. I can't believe that hits me. It's so dumb. Possum head. Charity is not actually that good for us, so we'll, we'll pass on Charity. Soul of Eden. Okay, so Soul Stones maybe are just bugged overall. Maybe it's something to do specifically with this character, but I doubt it. I'm just going to take Jesus Juice for now and be relatively happy with it. Um, Yeah, that's weird. It's quite weird. But soul stones are just unlocked for some reason, and I'm, I'm really un unsure as to why. Um, right, so... Now we can do one of... Oh, no, we need to go into our curse room first. Let me pick up that half red heart. Oh, my God, my back. From that, I don't know why, but from, from, the, from that run, my back is really hurting. I won't say hurting, it's more aching. Wouldn't have been something I thought would affect me too much, but yeah, my back is like, oof. Need to get more physically fit. Need to keep working at it. Finally, it triggered. Oh shit, it's actually pretty good. It's actually just like a lot of money we can get. Try to be careful with the cursed ones. Oh my god. This is a lot of money we can get from that. Wow, I was not expecting that. And again. Ow. We lost our burn heart, sadly. She gave us this. Pins and needles. Pins and needles. Take that, take that. And then we might as well use this to get out of here. Oh shit, I, I forgot about this room. I mean, it's, it's a good item, I'm glad we got it, but. Oh, bollocks sake, I got hit again. That's going to hit me a lot over the course of this run, I'm telling you now. That is going to hit me a lot. I forgot about this room. Okay, so we might not be able to get to the error room this floor. Might not be plausible. But a teleporter 2.0 run is always just a, just a blast. They're always, they always take a lot longer, but I never, I never really mind. Because this is like sort of the situation where min-maxing is just a lot of fun. So we want to go down here. We want to try and reroll for a battery, really. We do have a mini battery already. Um, Blood of the Martyr. I'm actually going to roll. I think we can get better.
And there is something better. That is a very, very good item. It's a bit laggy, but it's a fun item. And I'm going to bomb this to try and get a battery. Didn't get a battery. We did get this, though. Two laser rings at your position. The inner ring deals down. Okay, that's kind of interesting. Yeah, th there must just be some sort of weird bug with soul stones, either in general or specifically with this character. I'm not entirely sure which. But yeah, they're clearly showing up when they shouldn't be in all forms, like all the different soul stones. It'd be interesting if anyone would be able to decipher what the cause of that is. Ooh, we get Risk's Reward. Uh, can be used to reroll an item in the treasure room into one of a higher quality. Um, we do have two treasure rooms left. It's a very fun item. I'm going to try that out, you know. And honestly, let's go for nine lives as well, uh, just because our health is getting a bit low. I love you, Teleporter 2.0. I really do. Um, but I think this is where we leave you off. It's very confusing because I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm in an error room now. It's like, no, I'm not. You fool. Right. Let's go. Yeah, we unlocked Risk Reward recently and it is a really fun item. So I feel like I have to take it. Oh, God. I forget that I'm going to die really easily now, though. Damn it, Brimstone. You fuck. Not fair. I was really hoping for health up and I got tears down. So. <gasps> Contraband. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> damn it. Um, damn it. I really want to use Risk Reward, but if I use Risk Reward, it'll get rid of Contraband. The dilemma here is un unprecedented. Um, I think I'm going to leave Risk Reward and, and take the Contraband. I know it's stupid, and I know I just picked up Risk Reward and said how fun it is. But I am almost certain, almost certain there'll be an unlock for doing the Contraband quest. And I feel like I have to do it because of that. If there isn't an unlock for it, I'm actually going to be really upset. Um... But I, I feel like there has to be. It just seems like one of those secret things that isn't... It isn't so secret that no one will ever do it. It's secret enough that it's not going to be, like, super common. But yeah, it's, it's and it's got, like... Some co potentially cool rewards from it, too. Dude, fucking Big John, get the fuck out my face. <laughs> God damn it, Big John. This is annoying. I really wanted to use Risk Reward there. I really did. Chance to fire Petrifying Tears. Okay, I would very much like more health. I could crush some rocks, actually, if I wanted more health. Do careful that brimstone. There's a Soul Heart there. Beautiful. Oh my god, we got all white flies that time. Weird. See what's down here real quick, because there could be some good stuff in the member's access card room. There's a soul stone. Ooh, there's creatine. That is a very, very good item. Um, I will try and buy that if I can. We'll see what money we can get. Only like two more cents. Yeah, what the hell? It's just soul stones everywhere. It, I reckon it's an issue specifically with uh, Golem. One second. Yeah, I, I put it in the in the Discord, but no one's replied yet. I just wanted to check. Yeah, I reckon it's an issue specifically with um, with Golem. That's what I'm thinking so far. Because we've not had this issue on any other characters so far. But like I said, I have only just uninstalled that mod, so it could be to do with that. No, thank you. Give me all this other stuff, please. Missile launchers. I'm not exactly sure how this is meant to work, right? Oh, there you go. No, oh, for fuck's sake, I got hit by it again. 
That is such big bollocks, it really is. Okay, here's our money at least. Ow. There's a soul heart there though. Oh my god. <laughs> we might we might die on this run. This, this we played it too close to the edge and the game has punished us for our sins. Look, creatine powder is great. Uh Ipecac is still not giving item descriptions correctly for some reason. It's it's due to something they fixed with uh incompatibility. It's kind of a good fix to be fair. It was good that they did it rather than leave it. Um but yeah, we, we, we're without EID description so far. Also, the prismatic thingy hasn't cropped yet. Oh, for God's sake, it's so hard to remember that I can't run through that brimstone. It is so hard to remember. I don't think I'm ever going to get used to it. I don't know why it's hurting me, though. It shouldn't be. There's obviously something wacky going on that's causing it. Some wacky shit. Okay. Easy enough room here for us. Grab that real quick. Bring it down here. Crunch, crunch. Beautiful. Okay, at least we're getting some of the HP we're losing back. Not a lot, but at least some. Nice cap our box opening. It's kind of nice that we have what's it called here as well. Um, I can't even remember the name of it now. Schrodinger's Tears. Oh, not there's something. Oh, there's two enemies down here that aren't aren't dead. The heck? Oh, that's a lot of money, lovely. Sometimes chests just go nuts like that, don't they? And just give you fucking loads of stuff out of the blue. Without any real warning. You don't even have mum's key. It's just bizarre. But it's, it's lovely, but it's bizarre. Okay, that can also hit me. There is some shenanigans going on today. So many bugs are plaguing my game right now. Can anyone figure out what the hell's going on? I should not be able to be hit by these things. Maybe one of the golem trinkets? There's no fucking door to this bitch! <laughs> I've had to leave my other card behind to escape. God damn, my game is just plagued with bugs right now. Absolutely plagued. I don't know what's going on, but there is just nothing is working as it should be. Like, at all. It's actually crazy how, uh, how often we're seeing stuff like this. This run is just kind of a disaster. But we do have the contraband. I'm so annoyed we had to leave Risk Reward behind, but I really wanted to make this contraband work. This better have an unlock. It didn't even have an unlock. Spawn illusionary clone, um, illusion clones are the same character as you and die in one hit. Give it a go, why not? It's a 12 room, ooh, hello. Oh, shit! They have all my items and everything, I see. Oh, god, this is good. They don't plant a bomb with me, though. Well, holy, this is strong. He's dead already because of that. Fuck! <laughs> this is just upsetting. Where, where the hell's the secret room? I'm confused. Did it not howl in here as well? One sec. Howl's in there. Finish the howl. It's in here too, so it's got to be... It's gotta be there, one sec. I need to li I can never line this up correctly if I'm not if I'm in a double room. It's in here.
Enemies gain a random weak point. That's kind of good. I think I'm going to trade that for the, the, the potential laser damage that we're receiving right now. Oh my god. I am just clinging on to my life this run. Clinging on. Oh. It's so hard to avoid. It, it's so hard to avoid. We got the bag of bobbies. Bag of bobbies is pretty decent, we'll take it. Not amazing, but it's it's okay. I haven't seen anything else uh, unlocked that shouldn't be so far. Ooh, BFF is actually pretty damn good for us with uh, the bag of bobbies and stuff. Ooh, this is good. Also, pride pin's really good too. We'll see if we can afford that. Excuse me, did, I didn't want to exit quite yet there. We got contraband again. I mean, I kind of have to just keep taking it, right? <laughs> I feel like if the game keeps offering me the quest this much, I kind of have to take it. It seems like destiny at this point. Right, we know where there's some money, so let's go get it from up here. Unfortunately, I'm going to generate just an insane amount of wrath. Um, I, I don't know why I walked right into that. I'm going to generate an insane amount of wrath um, flies, which is going to mean I take a lot of damage, but we'll see how that goes. Pride pin, we need you. You are very, very useful. Game just wants me to uh, to lose my active item constantly. <laughs> like here, here's this contraband. Here's more contraband. You are now just a drug dealer. I am a drugs mule. That is all that I have become. Don't know why this job was given to me, but apparently yeah, it has been. It's weird. Oh my god. I'm trying to kill everything before my flies get a chance to do anything. Because in small rooms and stuff, it's just so difficult. I think bigger rooms are probably worse because I don't have as much control. Okay. Okay. Oh, there's both of you. Hello. There's a lot of maggots you guys are spawning. What the hell? Right. I didn't realize this was Mum's foot, but we're here now. Okay. We're pretty much set in stone here. That's pretty decent, I think. Yeah, that gave us plus damage. Good. Um, I'll check in here. Guppy's pride is a guppy item, so we could take it. I'm going to take it just because I think it's going to be funny with, um, with Bag of Bobbies, because now we're going to have a bunch of heads just flying around everywhere. Kind of funny. Uh, right. Down we go. Ugh. You have more contraband for you, sir. You've got your next delivery. Um, nice money equals power. Also, holy hell, we got scatter bombs. That's going to be something kind of crazy, I think. By the way, did BFF work? These familiars don't look bigger. Oh my god. Each one of those spawned locusts, each one of those spawned fires. We are definitely fucked. Yeah, I don't even know what hit me there. Just gotta accept my fate, I think. I'm just gotta accept my fate. If I use a bomb, I'm pretty much guaranteed to die. <laughs> but at the same time, how could I resist? 
Yeah, I swear BFF hasn't done anything. I didn't witness them grow in size when I picked up the item. Oh, we've got the new mom transformation. We got um, the knife on our back, but also 15% chance when we enter a room to have a foot stomp an enemy. It's pretty damn good. Pr pretty damn good. I almost said grud. Let's get some bombs down. <laughs> oh, Lord. This is going to be a mess. I like the way the, the bomb flies take a hot second before they start shooting stuff. Like, start, start uh, navigating towards enemies. They give me a little bit of time to kill stuff before they, they swoop in. When taking lethal damage, instead crush a trinket you're actively holding. Seems pretty good. Stomped on fella. I think 15% chance is a pretty good amount as well. It, it feels like it happens often enough to actually notice it happening, but not too often to feel like it's really overpowered. Because I feel like the foot stomps do a ton of damage. It could be really overpowered. But in regular rooms, it's only realistically going to kill one enemy for you 15% of the time. I feel like that's pretty, pretty well balanced. Ow. Fuck. I, I, I'm still a slave to uh, spawning more locusts for me. As much as they are incredibly dangerous and probably going to be my demise, they're a lot of fun. <sighs> I mean, we killed the boss, I think. Nope, we didn't. know what to say. Okay, we lost both of our trinkets and still lost a life, so that uh, that thing that we had that was um, going to save our life once. Oh, hello. Um, okay, I was like, why can't I escape? Apparently, we just have to exit and re-enter. Oh, this has been just something else, it hasn't it? Just something else. Old chest we don't have unlocked, but that is fine, I think, because I think rooms that are set with them um, rooms that are set with them like this, it doesn't make any difference whether they're unlocked or not. Still got hit there, apparently. Just stay still. The thing is, as well, now we have the mini... We have the mini bombs that are causing the same size explosions. Which is getting even more confusing. I don't think we can use any more bombs. The mum fight is already going to be very, very tough under our current situation, so... Fuck, really? Oh, I thought I could get out the door quick enough there. Apparently not. I don't even know if we're going to make it to the mum fight at this rate. It's not looking too hot, is it? Oh, for fuck's sake, stop. Enemies that have their invincibility bollocks. We better be going the right way here. I swear to God, we better be going the right way. Okay, good. We've got three attempts to do this on one HP. I think one attempt I'm going to try and use a bomb. <laughs> and then the rest, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll stick um, au naturel. Nah. Oh, no, wait, we did it. That did count. Okay. Somehow, against all odds, that actually worked out. I hope you guys enjoyed that run. That was an absolutely bizarre one. And yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one.